Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we actually have some big target leaks. We have new dates. We actually have internal stock, and we have a lot of major things going on. We have stock from the community. We also have just a lot of things. We also saw Target also even bugging and having like a weird little slight availability page popping up too as well. We have a lot of news to go and cover when it comes to the PlayStation 5 restock up at Target. And as I've been mentioning up on yesterday's video and also for this video, the Target drop is looking very very big i'm talking about still one of the biggest drops i've ever seen as well comparing it to other previous target drops as well it's very it's even bigger than the previous target drops that i thought were even bigger than before in the first place so this overall target restock is looking very very good especially if you guys are still trying to get a playstation 5 this also does include the digital xbox series x and s and just a lot of other things mixed on in so we have a lot of news to go and cover from this video uh probably more so also expected dates too as well and just a lot of kind of things to go and note throughout this video so if any of you guys are brand new i actually have a little bit of an extra sellout if you guys don't mind i am quite literally one sub away so i'm 37,500. so if any of you guys are just randomly here watching this you guys have been watching a few videos and you guys want to go subscribe we we'll love you guys usually youtube rounds on up as well so whoever just wants to do it i would love you <laughs> i appreciate it we also do have the ps5 giveaway going on too as well so if you just want to be entered in to win that all you guys have to do is go subscribe and pop on the notifications as well so i can give you guys sony news and video news free stock news etc as well we always do have the twitter and twitch stream a link down below follow the twitter if you guys would like the amazon links because amazon's still overdue we may actually have an update for that tonight as well i'm going to reach out for some contacts and go and see so be on the lookout for that but we have the amazon disc and digital link down below the weeble sign up for weeble deposit 100 dollars and you guys go get free stock and free money and coinbase which a lot of you guys keep on doing the coinbase one if you guys go buy 100 worth of any cryptocurrency you guys go and get free bitcoin those are always linked down below and any ads you guys see go towards my mom so let's go dive into this actual video itself so we have a lot to go and cover all throughout all this we have a lot to go cover so first of all if anything let me go and maybe go and make a touch on for the uh shipping glitch and target updates because usually this is kind of important news to go cover and then we'll go and cover until like, some more employee leaks and information and kind of go from community stock that's gonna be probably our format so we actually saw this up on twitter i saw this over here tweeting up on a tw uh to Twitter. that was bad english <laughs> so i was tweeting up to Twitter. So all this tweeted up to Cheeto. Why is it so, I don't know why it's so hard to go and say, it. but we saw this and I actually saw a few other people also mentioned too, as well as my Discord groups as well, where they basically had a Target go and have a little bit of a weird uh, switch up where they now have a ship it option too as well. That was kind of messed around and kind of just slightly unadded. And then also you can add it to your cart because there's a little bit of an issue, but it kind of shows that they were showcasing up some actual API changes. Now, if you guys remember on all the previous Target drops, if you guys have been here for a while, or if not, if you guys are new, basically Target does a lot of internal API things whenever they're about to go prep up for a drop throughout the week. That doesn't mean it's going to be like tomorrow, but they're more still messing around internal APIs, messing with the website, messing with the app, because they know they're going to be releasing uh, number one consoles, so people are going to have to buy them. And number two, they usually get a lot of traffic as well. As you guys know, everyone's trying to go get the console, while you guys watching the video included. So a lot of people usually go and funnel into the actual website itself and then they have issues they have checkout issues so they have to do like a lot of internal api messing around to make sure it goes smoothly or if they update stuff or they change how it's gonna be delivered all those things in general it's kind of really important for them to know and keep on updated so it's kind of a big thing overall that we're kind of seeing like these weird changes and as i mentioned on previous drops those are usually pretty nice indicators that it's more so on the way sometime soon so we also have another big thing to go and touch on too. Actually, let me go touch on this really quick too as well. So if you guys want to go and actually be a part of the community and go and send out the pictures, you guys don't have to, of course, just if you guys want to. I've had a lot of people go and ask about this. Move my webcam over to the very far side because these are basically always the bar uh the barcodes people always mention over here too as well i actually had a few people go and send me stuff up on discord just for the pictures so if i had this from some other person as well you guys can let me know because i think i see the down below at and stuff like this sometimes i just get sent stuff from discord so i just i never want to go and take someone's credit or something like that but if you guys know on this you can see it over there uh, when it comes to the disc, we have this with the barcodes, the digitals, the Xbox Series X and Xbox Series S. So basically, you guys could either go and pull out your phone, use the barcode scanner itself, go to the local Target kiosk, or even ask an employee, and then you'd be either go and type in the number, so like the 71171954, and then you guys go basically and see the internal stock for your store. Now, if you guys want to send me a picture or a video or a DM or whatever up on Twitter, I'm always okay with that, so I can show it up on the videos or just so I can at least know too as well, and we can kind of see which regions get a lot of stock. So I want to touch on that too as well so another thing to kind of go touch on is the employee stuff so this is kind of like at least to me more intriguing because this is new stuff so i'm going to go and show up what jake showed up a little bit ago too as well just really quick so you guys can see we actually have some of the dates on over here where we have a 14 on the way for march 25th 
vendor sony computer entertainment playstation console you guys can kind of go and see for some of the internals from employees looking at the barcodes etc so kind of a nice rough date to look at that but we actually have a new one now i kind of wish i knew where this source came from too as well because i've just been sent a lot of stuff up on discord so i don't have the proper sources if i find out i'll definitely let you guys know because i don't like i don't like taking information that i personally did like they deserve the credit you know whoever either leaked it or sent it out but we saw this now, this is a big one because I keep on telling you guys, I like to go and see when there's various other actual employees sending out information. So here, if you guys have never seen this before, are basic little iPhone, iPads that Target employees have. They carry them around. They can see when stock is showing on up. They can see whenever stock arrives. They could also see in-house stock as well. So from this one, they have two already in the actual house itself, like in the actual Target place itself for the PlayStation 5 console. They also have the also deliveries and audits and stuff like that too as well from all the previous dates the initial launch date as well and the last target restock which is on the 12 or not from the 12 from 12 days ago but you guys can also go and see they actually have 16 consoles playstation 5 consoles on the way on march 23rd from sony computer entertainment so now we're seeing other various different types of actual restocks going on in terms of other target locations so now we see a 23rd date we also saw some other stuff from the 25th date as well so a lot of kind of big news to be on the lookout for that so what does this kind of mean why am i talking about this so when it comes to dates Typically, a lot of retailers want to make sure most of their stocks have st uh, stock because it's an online order. You buy online for your local store, kind of how Best Buy does it, and then you pick up your local at the, your local Target. So at your local Target, they kind of have to have the stock there throughout that day or throughout the next few weeks because you basically walk into the store and pick it up and walk out the store as well because you confirmed your order. So they do sometimes want to have most of the stock available or at least have it all predetermined. So like, let's go and say if they dropped like today, then they'd probably have at least like a two day period to go get stock. Now, I'm not going to say they're going to drop today or tomorrow because they still have other consoles like on the 25th that might be shown on up. But what does this mean for the next date then? So. It could actually be even as late as like this week. It could be as early as this week. So it's kind of where we're watching it throughout this week in general. But as well, sometimes we have seen more dates show on up. So we have like a 23, a 25, then maybe like a 27 throughout the weekend. And then it might go drop throughout the weekend. Or not throughout the weekend, like on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of next week. And they build up stock on the weekend. So we kind of have to keep on seeing a little bit more information throughout the next few days. So I'll probably go keep on hitting up my target plugs and see if they get any good information or if they get more internal stuff like this and they can double confirm dates or anything of the sort. I don't like going and tell you guys unless I actually have confirmations. So let you guys know on this looking kind of good. We're seeing lots of big stock. We could show some stock in the community too as well in a second, but we've seen a lot of stock everywhere for Target and Target actually has internals showing up stuff. We have employees showing up stuff. So this Target drops looking very, very close. So that's why I always tell you guys to go subscribe or the Twitter or whatever. So basically I can give you guys any updates if we see any more good updates or dates or et cetera, or employee things mixed on in. Now we've actually been also seeing some other places too as well that may not have the biggest stock. Again, my boy May over here that actually went and checked and they have a zero zero on hand and back for normal consoles. But I always try to go and say that this is mostly fine because either they have the console show on up, like kind of from like all these internals where like they're on the way. So we have a zero on hand, but they might be shown on up. So they could even have stock showing up like today, tomorrow, the next three days or so. So that's always a big thing to note on that but as well also as we've kind of been seeing is that some drops are more so regional where some areas may have bigger stock than other ones as well so basically like maybe maybe one store will have like 30 stock 25 stock and then some store may have like eight or so so something you guys know up on that one we also have seen a few other stocks too as well that we've kind of been showcasing up on uh just over on the videos like here's a 25 plus on hand 27 in back PlayStation 5 console. That is huge. That's very, very big. Here's even another even bigger one over here as well. We kind of showcased some of these yesterday too with the 25 plus on hand, 43 in back. Oh my lord. These are huge. Like I keep on saying this target drop is looking very, very big. Very, very huge. We're now also seeing more employee confirmations too as well that we were showcasing up over here before too. Uh, and I, like I said, I want to find the source for this too as well because I just got sent the actual Twitter picture and stuff. I'll ask around my Discord groups and see. But like we're seeing all the stock showing on up very, very soon and we only have a few more days until this drop may have even happened. So on terms of dates and when it might happen, we'll probably have a more concrete answer in the next few days as we get more information. More so when we get more employee information from stuff like that that we just showed. And then when it comes to the next major drops as well, it kind of goes and 
shows that they could either be building up the stock or have a lot like the rough dates for us to be on the lookout for. So if I had to go and guess, it could either be later on throughout this week, like a Thursday, Friday drop time, or based on if we see more information from other employees, maybe more so in early next week, so they can have the weekend to kind of go and sort through stock and allocate stock. Most free stocks, as you guys probably know, don't usually happen on the weekends. We do sometimes see some walk-in news, such as the Myers stuff. And then uh, if you guys actually didn't check out that video, go watch the Myers video. We actually had a lot of good walk-in information overall stuff. Like I would actually re highly recommend it or the video from earlier on this week too as well on like the how to actually go get your PlayStation 5. That video is up on the channel if you guys want to go check out either one of them. I think I actually highly recommend them. But when it comes to target drop too, we kind of gone on the lookout. We're in the very, we're like in that mid stage where it's like about to happen soon, but it's not like imminent, but it's looking, it's getting closer and closer every day. So I'm trying my best to give you guys any updates. If we actually have any more updates, I'll also include those on my video later on throughout tonight too as well. Just so you guys can kind of go and see, relax, or get some good info off of that. But that's about it for this video. We actually had some good leaks, good, some good new information, some new stocks, some new stock everywhere, the actual target, like little, um, like I guess micro glitch, API update glitch. So this is looking pretty good, boys. It's definitely in motion. We're slowly getting stock. Thank you guys all so much for watching. Like I said, if any of you guys are brand new, I would love if you guys subscribe to the channel itself, especially for the notifications on to get your console or Sony news. As well, don't forget, we are giving out the PS5, so make sure you guys are subscribed for that. That's all you guys have to do to be entered. If you guys saw any ads, those go towards my mom, so thank you. So the Twitter and Twitch stream link down below if you guys want to follow up on either or the Amazon links for the PS5 disc and digital because that's overdue. That's also linked down below. And as well, we also have the Weeble. Sign up for Weeble. Deposit $100. You guys go get free stock and free money. Coinbase, you guys go buy $100 worth of any cryptocurrency. You guys go get free Bitcoin. And overall, hope you guys have a lovely day. Leave a like if you guys enjoyed and comment down below your thoughts. And I'll see you guys up on the next one. Thank you guys all so much. You guys are all amazing.